The USA finished runners-up at the last FIFA Women's World Cup in 2011. Part of that painful experience was Ali Krieger, who now has a second chance to claim the biggest prize. Now with Washington Spirit, she's had an eventful career. Krieger moved to FFC Frankfurt eight years ago. When I first arrived in Germany, everything was totally different. The culture, the people, the place, uh, the language. I was kind of in shock. I think that's what you want in your life. You want to be challenged. You want to be better, not only as a player, but as a person. And I think that's more of why I loved it so much. Krieger played every minute at the last World Cup, including a quarter-final against Brazil that went to penalties. That game was probably one of the best games in my career. Our goalkeeper coach had told us, okay, you're taking one, two, three, four, and, and he's like, in Krieger, you're five. I just placed it down. I didn't even look at the keeper, and I just went for it. I feel like I hit it with my purse, so I wasn't sure if it was going to trickle and she was just going to jog and stop with her foot, or <laughs> because it just was like, I was like, oh, God, you know, thank you, please make it. Um, but good thing it was far enough into the corner that she, you know, couldn't reach it. It was unbelievable. A 3-1 win against France in the semi-finals set up a World Cup final with Japan. We haven't stopped thinking about that moment for the past four years because we were that close. Going into the overtime period and going into the PK period, I was number five again, but unfortunately we didn't get that far. No matter why we lost, we were still happy because we knew we played the best we could. And then there was heartache. During qualifying in 2012, she suffered a serious knee injury and missed the London Olympics. Going through my injury in 2012 um, was probably one of the most difficult moments in my career. All of a sudden, everything just hit pause. A girl came in when we played Dominican Republic and just took me out from the side. I still haven't seen the footage because I just refused because I just, it was pretty bad. I had to then kind of adjust my attitude to just get back on my feet, not even think about football at that time. So it was a struggle for me. It was very difficult. It's been a long road to recovery, but now Ali Krieger can set her sights on glory for the USA. And she has a warning for their opponents. You're gonna see a determined, motivated, focused USA squad. We wanna come home champions.